how are we today? I'm doing just fine. My name is Lexi and this is Wax Elated, related to candles, wax, home fragrance, and more. And this is episode one of the Nighttime Candle Review, where I basically review new, classic, or upcoming candles in the calm evening nights. Um, this is the first episode, so this is a project that I just started. My intentions of this project, though, are to not only give informative, educated candle reviews, but to provide a calming, comforting video to listen to. Uh, because, let's face it, we burn candles mostly during the evening times, and candles, in a sense, are very relaxing tools for us, so why not provide a relaxing, comforting, homey, styled candle review? And I wanted it to be in a dark ambiance where you can see the beautiful flames as if you're in my home looking at it with me. So I will get started. The scent that I am doing tonight is Blueberry Maple Pancakes. This isn't a new scent, but this, comes, this scent comes back every single year. Um, this is a Bath and Body Works 3 Wick Candle in the beautiful packaging. I love the packaging of this. It reminds me of going into like a farm or a farmer's market and reading all the local produce or local bakery items that they have on a nice chalkboard etching. This isn't my first time purchasing this scent. I did purchase this last year. I am a big fan of blueberry fragrances. As you know, we are in the middle of blueberry season, so I thought this would be a perfect time to burn this candle. I also have a few other blueberry candles, but I don't know. Blueberries have gotten really popular over the past couple years in terms of candles, but um, yeah, I will get right started with this one. The notes on the candle are wild blueberries, griddle fresh pancakes, and maple syrup and essential oils. My first instinct of, well, my first thought of this candle reminds me of going back to Sunday mornings in my childhood. My mom would make breakfast on the weekends and pancakes were something that she could easily make without a lot of time and other people in my house preferred chocolate chip but I was the one that I preferred blueberries with blueberry syrup if it was available. Um, this also reminds me of going to Maine every summer, well not every summer but some summers and picking fresh blueberries off the bushes. In terms of strength, this candle it does perform pretty well when I walk into my living room where this is in, I can smell it and I know that it's present. Which, for a throw of a candle, that's all I really need to be satisfied. You know, a candle doesn't need to be going in every single room for me to enjoy it. As long as I'm in that room and I know that the aroma is present, I'm happy. Uh, the scent does linger though, so it is, a, it is on the stronger side. I would give it a medium to high throw. Um, it did linger over to my kitchen, and then when I did move it to my kitchen, it lingered into my bedroom and my bathroom. So on a scale of 1 to 10, I would give the throw about a 7, at times maybe closer to an 8, but for the majority of the part where I'm about a third of the way down, I would give it about a 7. In terms of popularity, I think this is a very likable scent. Um, if you really like berries, if you're a gourmand lover such as myself, or if you like breakfast scents, I think this would be a really enjoyable candle to you. I also think this would be a nice candle for children. I think kids love the smell of blueberries, blueberry pancakes. It kind of has that kind of cereal vibe to it, um, with blueberries, like blueberries. Or I have blueberry Eggo waffle cereal in my pantry right now. Kind of has a reminiscence to that. Um, so yeah, I think this would be a really popular candle for many. I think this would make a good gift. And this also gives me like a rustic country vibe, especially now that we're in blueberry season. Blueberries make really great transitional fragrances from summer to autumn. Especially right now, we're in the peak of blueberry season like I mentioned. But th at the same time, this is a scent that I think it could burn all year round, you know. I don't just have blueberry pancakes in the fall. I have blueberry pancakes all year round if I can get my hands on fresh blueberries. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, 
As far as this particular candle goes, I haven't had really any issues burning it. I have experienced no sitting, a little mess on the sides, but that's my fault for moving it room to room. The wicks are those thick wicks. They're not those flimsy, tiny wicks. I haven't had any puny wick issues. These seem to be strong, durable wicks, so I'm really happy about that. And what else should I say? Oh, this candle is also available in the single wick form if you do want to uh, if you prefer single wicks. This isn't like blueberry pie, if that's what some people compare it to. Blueberry pie is a lot stronger, in my opinion, and more emphasis as a gourmand candle. You get actually more of a pie note, a pie crust, than the actual blueberries themselves. Whereas this is more of the opposite. When smelling this on cold, you definitely get the blueberries first, and then the maple kind of mingles along with it. You don't really get a bakery note in this. Pancakes really don't have a smell unless you put things on them, right? Like butter or syrup or, you know, toppings. Pancakes by themselves, there really isn't a scent to them. So I really get mostly blueberry and maple blended together beautifully. If this were just to be called blueberry maple, I think it would be more realistic, but there really isn't a fluffy golden brown bakery note so if that's what you're looking for you might not find it in this candle but if you really like blueberries sugar maple syrup that's more of your this that's more of this candle so overall um on a grade level i would give this an a minus like i said i wish that there would be a more authentic gourmand note in here to make it actually smell like there's pancakes, but at the same time you do get that warmth of a gourmand candle, but the the golden, the cookedness, the, the baked aspect is not there. But this is a nice, sweet, juicy, blueberry scented candle. I think this would be well liked by many people, um, whether it's fruity fans or sweet tooths or, like I said, those who like breakfast scents. This is a nice scent to burn right now. You know, blueberries are nice in the summertime, maple scents are more prominent during autumn, so this is a really nice transitional burn right now fragrance. So I believe that's all I have to say for this candle. I highly recommend it. Will I purchase it again? I probably will. <laughs> so thank you for tuning in. I hope you guys have a beautiful night, day, wherever you are, and take care of yourselves and be safe out there. Have a great night. Bye-bye.